alive. Had one at Kaer Morin. <laughs> Please. A hundred loose an arrow if you saw that in the woods. Want it care more and <laughs> please. A basin of water. For teleprojection. A reflection of Ermion appears on the surface. Supplicants speak to it. Are you all right? Cut myself. The door's locked. The animals, they're alive. Yen, watch out. Monsters. Feel Hallucinating. You ran at Ermion's animals. Sword flailing. I had to calm you. Uh, must have looked strange. Your years of vigorous training at Kaer Morn finally paid off. Bested nearly all the stuffed beasts in here. Please. <laughs> Fine. We've passed the trial of taxidermy. The door stands open. Let's go inside, Geralt. I'll lock the entrance. We don't want to raise suspicions. Ah, our dear druid's laboratory. We must search it thoroughly. The mask of- Letter bearing Ermion's seal to the druids warns them about you, that brazen manipulator. <laughs> the wondrous world of insectoids. Didn't expect Ritual this. Hermione's Large wand. female. He's one of the few druids to. A sword and a stone. Things begging me to pull it out. <sighs> it's not in the stone, don't you see? It's held there by a vice.
Looks like Ermion places something in the statue's hand. What do you say we give it a pine cone? Hmm, nothing. Need something else. Gotta look around. Look at this. A detailed map of the Northern Kingdoms. Even shows spheres of influence over the ages. Out of date. A goat carved out of lindenwood. Signed, to Uncle Ermia. Laboratory worthy of an Imperial alchemist. Goes in for light reading, too. The Corpse of Novigrad by Sasha Hardy. Dwarven Triple Mead. Skelliger's tales about the wild hunt. The islanders believe the wraiths sail on a longship built of the claws of dead men. Child skull. Let's try again. So, statue, how about a skull? Hmm. Guess you're no indecisive prince. About a mug of mead. Statue or not, everybody needs a drink sometimes. Huh. Seems like it worked. Who would have thunk? Ermion enjoys jests achieved at the expense of others. I have a sneaking suspicion the mask will be in here. It. We must return to the feast quickly before. Careful now. Ermion enjoys jests achieved at the expense of others. I have a sneaking suspicion the mask will be in here. This is it. We've Careful.
that? I smelled it. Gas. Great still closed. Gotta think of something quick. The damn druid will poison us. This vapor's deadly. We've got but a few minutes. Teleport us out of here. Think of something. Quickly. First thing to come to your mind. Hold on tight. No greater act of valor than to fight a beast cursed by men and gods. No greater deed than that done to serve the goddess. Words of uncommon beauty. We thank you. And we'll take them to heart. But now, let's begin. We have seen Bran off to the beyond and must now choose his successor. A king must be wise, a king must command respect, a king must have bollocks! With no lack of men like that. Let those who feel worthy of the throne of Skelliger step forth! The sun could not be here this day. Behold his axe! Behold his will! May the best man a woman win! What's got into her? She's your daughter, is she not? Now I know why she said she'll sail to speak her of. Ah, children! The older they grow, the more trouble they are. Come with me. All the more essential we talk now. How was it, Geralt, when Ciri was nearing womanhood? I remember well her nan, her mother, what they were like. They say the apple doesn't fall far from the tree. Ciri was impossible to control, no telling her what to do. Had to have things her own way almost always. Why do you ask? No specific reason. She and Ceres, they're of a similar age. But we'll speak of my children later. First, let's speak of yours. Yennefer claims Ciri's in trouble, and you seek her. That's right. If you require aid, gold, ships, anything, Merely say the word. I'll give you all I can. And I know the last lives. I'm sure of it. When the blood of Rhiannon's daughters is shed, the sea grows white with fury. I'd mark such a storm. Need your help. Siri probably came here to Skellige. 
and very likely caused the cataclysm along the coast, the site upon which the druids focus so intensely now. A site Ermion refuses to let us explore. Specifically, he won't let me explore it. We fought. We're not friendly now. Don't concern yourself with him. Druids have little trust for mages. But Ermion's heart is in the right place. Am I right to assume he does not know you seek Ciri? It's of no concern to him. As I thought. At any rate, Art Skellig's my isle. You've my permission to investigate as you see fit. Thank you. No need. I swore an oath once. I aim to keep it. Unvolt! Tell the druid I must speak to him. At the usual spot. I have one more matter to broach. My children. You remember Yalma? Well, he swore an oath to kill the giant of Undik. Set off and has yet to return. Whereas Ceres announced that she's to set off on an adventure of her own. Got it in her head that Udelric is not mad, but cursed. Giants. They've been extinct for ages. Anyone actually seen the one on Undvik? Aye. Dozens of refugees have. The giant drove everyone off the isle. I've welcomed what remains of Clan Tordorachir and Artsgelig. I heard a rumor that an unnatural frost gripped Undvik before the giant appeared. It is true. At any rate, Yalmar decided to kill the giant and give the isle back to its people. A deed worthy of a king, he believes. My son gathered a hearty crew at the new port. They were to sail to Unvik, then travel on foot to Oskar, the village. But that many lads should have killed the giant long ago. Thus, I thought to ask you. You should start at the new port. Ask around. Hjalmar might have told someone there his plans. Wondering. Got no plans to vie for the crown yourself? Think a good number of the Jarls would support you. A good number? Those opposed would be fierce, rabid. Madman Lugas would sooner see an elf guardian on the throne. Besides, a man should know when to step aside. Hand the tiller to the youth among us. Take it Ceres wants to lift the curse. There's no curse to speak of. Ceres has decided she must match Yalmar and sort out a deed worthy of a queen. Think she might need my help? You did plan to ask me for it. Why? The thing is, I don't trust Ulrich further than I can spit. Ceres won't listen to me, or her brother. Yet confronted by a professional, who will explain why she's mistaken, she just might come to her senses. So yes, I ask that you explain things to her, and bring her back. If either Yalmar or Ceres need help, I'll help them. I thank you. Now that we're done thanking one another, let's get to work. We must determine if Ciri is still on Ardskellig. I'll change into travel attire and find you. Head south. The anomaly we should investigate destroyed a stretch of forest along the shore of the bay. A successful feast on all counts, Krach. I will see you later. <laughs>